Okay, it's uh, October 6th, 2016, and we're getting ready for Hurricane uh, Matthew, which is supposed to hit in about uh, four or five hours. It's uh, 4, 4.20 p.m. right now. You can see here, I'm taking a shot. We got the shutters up. There's Kathy. We got to see the, that's the kitchen there. That's the living room. This here is a bedroom. This is the green, that's the green bedroom. Shutters, I'm panning around. There's the neighbor's house. I'm panning around, there's the mango tree. I'm panning around. Okay, there's the green room, that's the other window in the green room. There's the office there. There's the two windows, both of those both of those windows are in the office, and that's the master bedroom there. There's the pool equipment. I got, you see, I got the statues. I took the statues and I put them down, except the big one there. The tree there is my bougainvillea hedge. We'll walk around to the other side of the house now, and into the backyard. There's the, uh, no, no big flooding yet. You can just see a big puddle there, but probably tonight this street will be flooded. Here's my mailbox. There's the bougainvillea in the, in the front yard. My two arborvitaes. Those two big trees there are arborvitaes. And then let's walk, uh, there's uh, my vehicle, FJ, everything in good order. Here, we're walking over to the other side. This is the north side of the house now. That's the garage window. Got a piece of plywood there. That's all the uh, power meters. There's the AC unit. There's the laundry room window. I got some plywood on that. Okay, I got that. Uh, here's my bougainvillea uh, hedge on the other side. And there's the, I put that, that's purposely, that wind didn't blow that over. I purposely turned that over so the wind doesn't blow it over. You can see now here, this is the, uh, that's the bedroom in the back. That's the uh, mother-in-law suite in the back there. And then that's the Florida room. That's the flat roof, flat roof, Florida room. Okay, you can see more statues that I put down there. You can see the lake banana trees, the lake uh, is not, sometimes the lake will come up over that seawall there and it'll come up into the backyard. Right now it's not doing that. It's just, they got it drained really low and they do that purposely for when the hurricane hits because it'll come up and it's been way up in the backyard, way up to right here before that lake has been up high. But you can see the statues I put, uh, I put over. There's some bananas I cut down this morning because uh, I know the wind would knock that banana tree over and maybe knock the fence over so I cut that down to get some weight off of the fence. And then we got all the patio furniture down inside the pool. I don't know if you can see the patio furniture is down inside the pool. That statue I'm going to leave up because that's been up through three or four hurricanes already over the past 20 years so that doesn't nothing blows that thing over. That thing's heavy. That's probably about 500 pounds. But uh, you can see here, this is the uh, master bedroom. This is the back, the west side of the master bedroom. And this is the, uh, that's the bathroom. These are little bougainvillea plants I got here. And uh, I just wanted to do a panning of everything. You know? I got the door, you can see the door I got secured too. I got the door shutter up. Got two screws on the top holding that, good. And I got some bricks holding it down here on the bottom. But I just wanted to do a pan of everything. You can see everything, uh, no trees knocked over. Hopefully tomorrow morning when I take the other video, it's gonna look just as good. It won't have much damage, but you know, we'll see. It's got uh, 140 mile an hour winds. I don't know how wh which one we're gonna get hit with. You know, It may move a little bit uh, east of us, hopefully. So we're keeping an eye on it. And so, uh, Roger out for right now.